What was your favorite part behind the scenes with you guys? Hmm, perhaps getting bit by mosquitoes. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you enjoyed that part? That was fun for you? No. I... <laughs> Not even the bugs in New Orleans could get in the way of the on-screen romance that's being likened to classics like Love Jones and The Notebook. I'm wondering if it's not too early in the night to kiss you. It's an updated version, you know, all that stuff is beautiful and it paved the way for us, but now here's a, here's a 2020 version. Do you feel a responsibility to have, be part of projects like this that show this beautiful love? I feel like we don't get to see that all the time. Not even a responsibility, it's it just, just comes natural, you know, right. like it's what I want to see and this it's what, what I want, live, yeah, you know? Watch, yeah. yeah, absolutely. That is a picture wrap on Miss Issa Rae. Yeah. And with that, Issa completed her first dramatic leading role, a new challenge for the actress who is best known for her HBO comedy, Insecure. Was that different for you, coming from everything else you've ever done? For me, I just yeah, tend to lean on humor, and so this character was not necessarily absent of humor. She has a sense of humor, but that's not what necessarily drives her. The entire cast was amazing, and everyone kind of forces you to step your game up. Both Issa and Lakeith step up the style game on the red carpet, so we took them down memory lane. Do we remember oh, wow. these fashion moments? Why y'all pick my worst? <laughs> <laughs> this is, this is not the worst. This, this is, is the worst? Oh my God, I like the colorful one, but y'all don't pick one is bomb. <laughs> Look at the hair here. The fashion in the left is bomb. The hair was a choice.